Boy, I'm telling you, that dance. We'll get you to what started that dance. Walk them off, young man. Seven to six. Arizona is victorious. Dance followed by a shower, as you can see. Wendy's brings us these highlights. They brought us this contest. So four to nothing at one point was the score, and then ASU came all the way back. Not only did they come all the way back, but this two-run homer put ASU on top on top in this game and all the crowd was giving him a hard time he let him know right back connor davis there was an add-on run as well a big add-on runner so it felt for hunter hoss but then mac bingham helped things come all the way back down a pair bingham with the triple all the way around with bingham's triple comes the speed of chase davis he scores Tommy Splain on a good breaking ball shoots it into center field ties this game up at six Back and forth we went. Ying and Yang on to the 10th. Chase Davis, we talked about him scoring earlier. Tell me if he didn't lean on this. You're kidding me. Davis, who leads the team with 12 home runs, hit it into the night on top of the Terry Francona hitting center. On Tito's birthday, by the way, and Chase Davis, who watched so many games last year on that bench, had not earned a lot of playing time, is the hero yet again tonight. A huge victory for the Arizona Wildcats. That was a good-looking dance. Ivaroff in the end pitched pretty clean. It was a was an important part of this game until giving that one up. Trevor Long was huge. Davis, Connor Davis as well. You can see the timely hitting for both of these teams. That's game one. What does game two and three have to hold? Come find us, 5 o'clock Pacific tomorrow night. We'll tell you all about it. Until next time, we'll wrap it for now from Tucson.